Welcome to Homes for Sale Atlanta. I'm your real estate agent and advisor, Lorenzo Reed with Remax Metro Cityside in downtown Atlanta, Georgia. Today, we're at 3000 Milton Court in Conyers, Georgia at a home that is listed by Virtual Realty Properties and that listing agent is David Martinez. This home, this three bedroom, two and a half bath home can be yours for $219,955. It features being on a corner lot that has a wrap around driveway. Now, if you're that type of person where you like for the people to, and you yourself to come in, pull into your two car garage, or for your guests to be able to pull in and wrap around when you're having your events, when you're having your parties, this is a home for you and the landscaping is magnificent. I love the way that the trees are set up on uh, um, with the bricks that you just saw a few seconds ago. So let's go inside, take a look at this great home and let me help you to make this your home sweet home. All right guys, so before we go in inside, I want you to see that this is a four-sided brick home and I love the way the archway is set up for your entryway, which gives it a nice appearance with the um, white um, accents and this beautiful door. So let's go take a look inside of this four bedroom, three bedroom home. It can be four bedrooms. I'm gonna show you why a little bit later on. So as you come inside the home, you're greeted in the foyer with a very open situation, open plan. But first I wanna show you on your left hand side, your right, we have a the entryway from the garage door that also features the laundry room. Now you guys know for me, this is gonna be a very important thing. Because this house does feature a master on the main. And having your master on the main, I like my laundry room where I am. So as we come into the home, um, on our left, we have a brilliant archway that leads into what is a formal living room area. And this can be your library, this can be just where you set up um, just a few furnishing pieces, but really you can set this up as a library, a place to read, a place to greet your guests and enjoy yourselves. But I love the way that they have the hardwood floors that transition from the tan floors in the foyer. And then we come into the kitchen area, which transitions into another floor set that gives your home separation. Now within this area, we have our breakfast nook. And it flows into our eat-in kitchen where we have an eat-in countertop, a diner counter, a lots of counter space to go into this gourmet kitchen. We have a five grill gas burner. The kitchen's being remodeled right now. So it's in a great situation. On, and this whole house sits on half an acre, almost half an acre, guys, with a brand new Samsung refrigerator, smart refrigerator. It's a beautiful home and it also has an exit way into more of the family area. But we're gonna go through the flow of this home and show you how that works uh, as we get into the family room. But we come from there, from your kitchen, you're serving into your formal dining room that does have a view of the backyard. And it's in a great backyard, guys. You really don't love the backyard. But this is a very good sized formal dining room where you can have your big, long, eight people table that does create the separation with the in-wall columns that allows for you to come into an incredibly 20 plus foot high ceiling of a family room that has one of my favorite things, which is a fireplace. And I love the wood and marble accents for this fireplace. And I want to show you something really special in this family room. If you are a pet lover, we love the animals, right? So yes, the family pet church has its own space right here where, I mean, a built-in home for church or whatever your dog name is, Fio, you know, Spike, whatever the name. I know that's old school names, but that is a great option. And before we go outside, before I show you the master suite, let me show you that downstairs when your guests are here, you do have a half bath. And of course, we know the Master Suite is the piece de la resistance. So we do have our half bath down here. So that you guys can know that you have that with a closet. Can't see the Master Suite suite on the main. The Master is on the main, but you can't see that yet. That's the last piece, that's the piece de la resistance. 
So we have to go and let's take a look at this backyard. It's a very um, interesting backyard. So let's say you are a young family with small children or you just want privacy, having a private event. You have your first portion of your backyard sectioned off that allows for if you have small children, they can play out here within the safety of the confines of a smaller area, which also gives you privacy if you're having a private event with you and your family. But then as the children grow older or you're having a larger event, you want them to have more space, then they have a larger backyard that is also uh, fenced in with iron, the rough iron fences. Uh, that continuous stream of the uh, backyard flowing out here from the brickwork. But this yard gives you plenty of room for whatever your size family is to grow, to have fun, to have family events. Your home will be the picnic home. Your home will be the barbecue home. So uh, if you like to entertain, this is a great backyard if you like outdoor entertainment. So let's go inside, take a look at the bedrooms upstairs, and then that master suite. All right, guys, I wanted to show you the stairwell. I love the way that the stairwell comes up and it curves around, which gives, you know, a great look to the home. So as we come up and wrap around these stairs, we will be greeted with our first bedroom. And walking into this bedroom, it has a very good sized bedroom that faces on the side of the home. It's facing west. So like I said, if you're you know, a family, ready-made family, growing family, it's a great space to be able to grow and build your family. It's a very good sized room. And from that one, right next door, we have our second bedroom. I'm gonna say that was a young man's bedroom based on the color. I'm gonna say that this is a young lady's bedroom based on the color. But it could go either way because you can do and design your room however you choose. But this bedroom, it's a good sized bedroom. It's slightly smaller than the bedroom next door, but still provides you with great spacing. This bedroom is right across from the shared bathroom uh, for both for the upstairs. Full sink, toilet, tub, and shower. Now from there, what could be a fourth bedroom or an office or a playroom or a nursery, whatever you decide, is this huge upstairs loft area that gives you plenty of space to be able to work from home or if this is an area for the children to have a playroom or a study or anything of that nature, you can design this however you decide, whatever your needs are to truly make this your home. So let's go back downstairs and take a look at the piece that it resistance, the master suite. All right guys, so welcome into the piece that are resistance, the master suite. Now this master suite is a very good sized master suite with vaulted ceilings. You do have a private entryway outside. The very large, almost floor to ceiling windows, which brings in a great natural lighting. The house faces, the, faces west and slightly and south, this bedroom. And from there, we go into our master bathroom. Now, as you come in, you'll see that this master bathroom will have dual his and her sink with seating for the vanity. And as we come in and through, we'll see that it has a garden tub facing west of the home, so you can take that bath cow and take me away while I watch the sun set over the next door neighbor. <laughs> and then that interesting doorless shower. I love the tower on the shower and the um, the little back uh, in, in cage so that you can hold your soaps or what and whatnot, which also features a private toilet. And then we go into our master closet. This master closet is has plenty of space. A lot of your shelving has already been put in place, uh, so you and you can even add more shelving. There's plenty of room for him, his, and hers, as well as an island or seating. So this is a great home, whether you're retiring, whether your family is bigger, or your family's growing, you have a small children, and you're looking to grow your family. With this backyard on almost half an acre of land, this three bedroom, two and a half bath, which could be a fourth bedroom upstairs, can be yours for 
$219,955 in Congress, Georgia. So if this home is the fit for you, if this is the house that's really speaking to you, then contact me, Lorenzo Reed, with REMAX Metro Cityside in Atlanta, Georgia. Look at the number below. Give me a call. Let's make this your home, sweet home.